Oh, all sorts of good stuff here happening here at Belmont Park today. Not only is it July 4th, Independence Day, not only is it a beautiful day, but the Naira Betts Late Pick 5 kicks off. The Naira Betts Late Pick 5 will be offered in the last five races, all racing days. You can play it on Naira Betts. You can play it throughout New York State as well. You can play it on track. But if you play it on Naira Betts, you can be eligible to be the lone winner. And that means if there's one winning player, they get $100,000 guaranteed for hitting the Naira Betts Pick 5. The sequence begins race number five, and I think it's an absolutely terrific sequence. Seven furlongs on the Widener turf course. For me, I want to use two horses in here. I like the eight, Jermaker. I think this horse is very interesting coming off a layoff for trainer Nick Zito. The turf races last year much better than they look against good competition, as well as the 11, Ordinaire. Now, Ordinaire has to deal with the pace and stalk in here, but if Ordinaire gets back to his best races last year off the layoff, he's much the worst to beat. I'm going to use eight and 11 as my main two in the Naira Betts late pick five. You go to race number six, the second leg of the pick five. I want to use the three wrapped. You can use the four in here, Mr. Harlan, the one dream doctor. With the scratches, one, three, four look like the main players in here, but the three wrapped is my pick. An improved horse is coming off a layoff and countered trouble last time and overcame that trouble to be a close third. I went three, four, one in race number six. The third leg of the Naira Betts pick five. I found this to be a very interesting race. I would use three horses in here, and I would not use the four Emancipation, the full to orb. I know he's impressive winning his debut, but he got a very strong pace to close in to win that day, and another horse who closed well in that pace did no running whatsoever in a maiden race yesterday. I would use the one Dogtown, who I think is a major threat to wire the field. The three Vincento just seems like a logical possible player, but my top choice is the five Tail of Mist and a price. And I've got some prices in here, and if you want to be the lone winner of this thing, you're going to need some prices in this play somewhere. And the Five Tail of Mist for Barkley Tag coming off a layoff. Hasn't run in almost six months. Ran very well last time at Gulfstream. A race worth watching. And Tail of Mist needs to improve a little bit, but just a little bit in his last race. Better than it looks. So I went 5-3-1 in race number seven. The eighth race, the Manila. A lot of people will be singling the three big handsome. And on a relatively limited budget, I think that makes a certain amount of sense. Having said that, this is the toughest race the Big Handsome has been in, and he's going to face the one bricks and mortar who can win this race, a horse who's won two races out of two starts for Chad Brown, and the four Holiday Stone, who's actually my top pick, who had significant trouble last time at the Penn Mile for the white-hot George Weaver barn that's really turned it around. Even the seven Secretary of War can win this race. I went 4-3-1-7 in the Manila, the eighth race. Big Handsome's the one to beat. I get laying heavily on him, but I don't think this is a one-horse race. Now, I do think the ninth race is somewhat of a two-horse race. If you want to go thin, I would use the one Daring Destiny, a second-time star for Linda Rice. We know her maiden second-time stars can be very dangerous, as well as the five, the Pooch, who was way the horse to beat, getting back the turf for trainer Mitch Friedman, claimed out of his debut, which could have been a winning debut, got a little bit lost in that race, finished second. I went 1-5 in here, used the two horses to close it out. The Naira Betts pick five kicks off today. It'll be offered Every day at the Naira tracks in the last five races, you can play it on Naira bets. You can play it throughout New York State, including here at Belmont Park, up in Saratoga, and even Aqueduct when we get there. But you want to play it through Naira bets, and you want to be a member of Naira bets to play it. You play through Naira bets, and you are eligible if you are the only winning player of this pick five. You will get a guaranteed payoff of at least $100,000 as the Naira pick five kicks off today, July 4th, Independence Day at Belmont Park.